Welcome to the Devil's Pulpit. Now the Devil's Pulpit used to be known as the mushroom shaped rock that could be sometimes seen poking through the crimson red stream. Some say the mushroom rock is where the Devil stood to address his followers, whilst others believe that it was a place where the witches held their executions, hence where the folklore of the river runs red comes from, as the Red River gives it an eerie sort of sinister look and that name fits very well. Though its colour isn't actually the work of the devil at all, it's merely a result of the underlying red sandstone. Other say druids would host secret meetings down here, hidden in the dark shadows of the looming walls of this gorge. Now to get down here, you have to climb down some incredibly slippy stones. There is a rope tied off that you can use to help you descend and ascend up the, the stones, because they are almost vertical. It is a bit of a scramble to get up and down here. Right here, behind me, this bit of redstone was where a scene out of Outlander was shot. Put the information up on screen for you to see there. This is where a particular scene, something about Liar's Stream or something. I think the scene was called Liar's Stream. This is where they shot it, right here, behind me. I can only legally refuse to hand you back to Randall if I change it from an English woman to a Scot. Although it is a bit of a shame this this place got popular a few years back got a bit of a name for itself and it's a lot of a lot of the public have came to visit it but when you get public and the more people that you get you obviously get litter and there are well there is a lot of litter everywhere nature is very forgiving and some people do come and clean it up. It is very nice that there are some volunteer parties that come and clean this. I'd hate to see what it was like without the, without the volunteers, so thank you very much for coming to clean it up after, after inconsiderate people just throw the stuff around. How to tell when you're in Scotland. By the way, I think the reason for the trainers hanging up, so that is the start of the Devil's Pulpit, or the end, depending on your walk. And I think the reason people throw their shoes up there is after they've completely destroyed them in the pulpit because i think people don't come with the intentions of uh getting wet but of course they do i mean it's not great that they're throwing them up there but i think that's why they do it it's just, it just seems to have become a thing it might not look that high trust me this is high i'd say we're about 60 foot yeah <laughs> i had no idea that cows went into the devil's pulpit. <laughs> That's like a hundred foot down, by the way. You won't be able to tell on the camera very well, but yeah, I'm a hundred foot above this right now. <laughs> Just spotted a load of cows down there. Interesting. The devil's cows. Slaughterhouse, a natural slaughterhouse. Guys, you're crazy. People love the street. I only just celebrated a thousand subscribers. I'm already at two. I can't keep up. All these comments. Thank you very much for all the support. It's absolutely brilliant. I feel really guilty when I can't reply to all of your comments. I'm trying. But there's been like 700 comments in a few days. And I work full time. It's very difficult. So I, if I don't respond to all of you, very sorry. I, I have read it. I will have definitely read it because I do read them all. Thank you very much, guys. It's an unbelievable sport lately. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you in the next one.